We were extraordinarily fortunate to receive a $25 million gift from one of our most generous alums, Rajan Kelachan, to endow the Honors College and to make sure that it goes on in perpetuity. It's amazing that after this gift of $25 million that Mr. Kelachand has followed with a gift of $10 million that will allow us to renovate what is now Sheldon Hall, not only to have the administrative offices of the college in a central location, but to have the students live together and gives us the opportunity to have faculty and students meet outside of the classroom. We're all living together so that when it's a history assignment, I can just walk right down the hall and find my friends who are in international relations. We're all there to help each other out and give each other advice. It's very much part of the rest of the university. We expect to have non kilochon students um, in the hall. I think that there are certain things you learn about each other from being in a class together, uh, but it's no substitute for the kind of closeness and intimacy that the students develop with each other. Education is going to be a key driver of how we handle the future. I was lucky to get education from a great country and a great institution like BU, and I know what it, how it shaped me. It was BU which made my mind come truly global. Living in the residence halls with people from so many different places really permeates your worldview and that changes the way you learn and the way you live and how you tend to act as you grow in your college life. And the mission of the Honors College is to try to rethink and renew undergraduate education, combining some of the real classic virtues of liberal education with modern approaches. And the gift enables us to do things that we certainly would not have been able to do under any other circumstances. I think at the end, you're going to produce truly a, a Renaissance person, true leaders of the world of tomorrow.